Okay. How many times before that have you had you been in the four building though? Probably like ten. Come on, son. Son, probably like ten. So I was ending off the island, son. I was catching mad little cases, son. Going there for a week, going in there for two months. Yeah, son. Cause I used to be digging in Midtown, son. I used to be catching mad little cases. I've been on the island like, son. You know how many times I've been on the island, son? What was your longest stay in the four building? My longest stay in the four building was probably like. Uh, Probably like a year, probably. Probably like a year. And that was in '89. Yeah, I did. I did. I did most of '89 in the four building. Most of '89. Then I went up north. When I went up north in '89, I stayed for um. Excuse me. I stayed for uh. Like probably a month and a half. But I came back. I went. I came back. I came back in January of '90. I came January of '90. I came back like the end of January, like January 20-something, I came back. Like I went up November, like November something. I went up, I went up in November, because I remember I was the 89B number. And I came and I um came back down in 90. Like I went back, I came down and um, I came down from the cap. And that's mm-hmm. how I remember I was in the cap. When I came back down from court, I was in cat sack. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And that's when I went to um, Too Low. I mean, who's on the island from 89 from New York that's, that you remember in like 89 in the four building? It was there, all right? Let me see. God, like, it was like, it was, let me see who was there from the start. Let me see, I had to go by like each, each like um, section. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like from the start, you had, uh, you had, uh, you had little BB was there, like I told you, B.O. brother BB. You had do some four green, like little NA. Little NA was there. Um, you had NA Rock was there. Little NA Rock. Um, little NA um, from NA Rock. Little NA from um, Nostrand Avenue. That they said went crazy, but son used to get in there. Son was there. Um, who was there? Uh, um, Moo 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 from Four Green was there. Um, was Bumstead there? I think Bumstead was there. Um, little Bumstead from Fort Green was there. Um, Lucky was there. Lucky Ben cousin. Lucky from Astoria. Lucky was there. Um, Chat from Pink Houses was there. AD from um, Cypress was there. Pink Houses, Cypress, AD was there. Um, who else was there from um, Brooklyn? Uh, little little shorty Cypress was there. Um, big Ron dude from Queens was there. Bless the dead, he died too. He got killed from like, Forty Projects. The dudes that was on the island like in Sparfit back in like he was a dude from Sparfit with he was in Sparfit with me and Shu and all of that. And then when I came to the island. My first, like, in the island in 88 and 89 and all of that, son was still there on the island. He was one of them giant big dudes. You know how, like, when we was in adolescence, we got the dudes that's, like, big dudes look like they could be adults. He was, like, even in, in school, they was, like, the biggest dude in the class. But not that, like, just a big dude. Like, us were way bigger. Like, you know what I'm saying? So at that time when you was there in 89, like, what was the robbery game like? Like, niggas was coming through with all type of sheepskin. Yeah, what type of what type of shit niggas was coming nah, through with? Dudes, dudes, dudes was, you know, back then, dudes was coming through, like, you know, on out. Dudes was like, uh, you know, you know, everything was low stuff. You know what I'm saying? Low stuff. Everybody was coming through. You know, Brooklyn, dudes was, you know, everybody, you could tell what dude from about the shoes that he wear. Like, you know, Uptown dudes gonna have a pair, you know, Uptowns on. Like, you know, some Air Force Ones. You know, Brooklyn dudes, they're gonna be rocking NBs. You know what I'm saying? They're rocking New Balance, all the different 576s and stuff, whatever color. Because that time they was coming out with the different color 576s. Like, you know, different colors. They first came out with the boy blue or with the all red or, you know what I'm saying? Dudes were kind of, you know, coming through with the different, you know, um, color um, leather re boxes, like, the, like, look like the, um, the, the suede, like, look like kind of like the 5411, but like, for the men, like the same one takes coming out with different color suede Reeboks at the time, you know, um, you know, regular stuff. So, and, you know, but dudes really want to shine. You know, dudes take footwear from you, you know, footwear, 
you know, your footwork, but you know, we was on shine because we were smoking weed. So, you know, that's how we get the weed. Like, you know, the adults got the weed. So we used to snatch, you know, the chains and the shine for the adults by the, 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 the jewelry from us and give us the, um, the balloons, give us the weed. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So we was on, the, the, I was on jewelry, me. You know, I, I, I'm a robbie for jewelry. For really, I just a robbie for anything. I was petty. I did rob dudes for all type of stuff, bro. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, the robbery game was sweet. You know what I'm saying? You got to get a pass. You get a pass to go to the law library or the barber shop or whatever. And we learned the hallways, you know. Or, you know, the pens. You know, the pens is very, you know, the pens is lovely. The court pens, you know, we from Brooklyn. So, you know, well, we play any pen. We play any pen but Brooklyn pens. Because ain't nobody in Brooklyn pens got nothing. Because everybody is robbers. <laughs> so, you know, we play that first pen. Over there, when you first come in, like the reception pen is right there by the the, the office of that, and you know because everybody that's coming in from court, like the new admissions going there. Mhm. Mm and niggas going and niggas on bail. Yeah, and bail and new admissions and all of that. So we love playing that pen. You know what I'm saying? We play that pen or we play the. You know, our favorite pen was the Manhattan pen. The Queens pens is alright, but the Manhattan pens because everybody in Manhattan is hustlers. You know what I'm saying? So them be the dudes coming in with stuff. Cause you could tell basically where a dude come from based on his charge, like back then. You know what I'm saying? Like dudes coming in from like robbery charges, murder. You know, everybody had murder charges, but mostly murder charges. Dude mostly be from the Bronx or Brooklyn. Like you know, adolescent they be from Bronx to Brooklyn. Robbery charges. The majority of dudes with robbery charges be from Brooklyn. The majority of dudes with drug charges really be from Manhattan and Queens. You know what I'm saying? And dudes with like burglary charges be from Queens. Um, back then, dudes, you know, any arson charges. Do, that you, was do you remember any? Was it anybody from Staten Island on the island with you that you remember? Let me see. From Staten Island, it is one dude that was from Staten Island that was rapping. I gotta get his name. What's his name? Let me see his name. Son was from Staten Island, and son used to be in the Lower East Side. What's his name, man? His name gonna come to me. And I seen son on the alley. I, I don't know if he got killed. I think I heard son about him, but I seen son on the alley when I was there in um in, in, in 2000 when the, when I, you know what I'm saying, had the violation. Um, London. His name was London. I think I think I heard of that nigga. Yeah, son get, son get busy. Son, me and son got into it before. Son fake try to cut me when um they try to, when we, and while I was, we was in the thing together, Dudes didn't know who I was, but these were some big monsters, and I just came down. This is when I came down from up north, you know what I'm saying? And um, these dudes was already in the big, big monsters, and I was in there for cutting something, and some of them was in there, and I went to wreck. You know, this is how we used to get to the big pins. Like, when we go to wreck, we cut somebody in the yard so they could send us, so they could bring them on, take us to the pins, and we'd be in that pen right there, the big pins right over there by, when you right there by metal, when you come out, when you're coming out the, um, receiving room and you got to where the business at you know that that pin right there mm -hmm. that pin that's you talking about that why you talking about the why me pin that's right by the I, visiting room yeah the why me pin right by the visiting room the yeah. one that's right by the, by the visiting room you could go over medical you can see right there in the hallway yeah that's, that's the cell they put you in when you cut somebody yeah when you come in here yeah, they put you in there like when we roll out in the shoe that's where they bring us to they either they bring us there or they bring us to the seven and eight pin you know what i'm saying but that's where they usually bring us to you know what I'm saying? Because they be having court in the morning. And you know, we do this when we go to wreck in the morning. You know what I'm saying? To um to wreck. I had just got to the shoe. This is my first time going to wreck. I had just got to the shoe. And um when I went when I went in a um when I went in the um the yard, um London tried to um London tried to grab me and the dude named Jamaican dude named Scar, they used to call him Jamaican Scar, try to act like he tried to cut me. And I, and, I, and I pushed them and swung on them. And then um, dudes grabbed everybody and the police came and nothing had, we just all slid back up. I'm like, oh, I'm seeing them. Then when I got back up and they ain't all of them was all in the shoe at the time, everybody was in there. They were like, what happened? What happened? They was like, what happened? Everybody knew something happened. I was like, yo, some clowns. They like, who? They like, what? They like, nah, that ain't happened. So we all going out there tomorrow. They're like, they try to cut you. I'm like, yeah, these they like, we going out there tomorrow. Come on, this is, this is Bing Red? And being like, we didn't have no case, we just had the yard, you know what I'm saying? And but in the other buildings, like in the adult buildings and stuff like that, and um, in, 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 in the yard, you go in cages. 
you said you ain't yeah. going no cages when you go to Ping Rack. You said you said you told niggas that the kid London tried to cut you and y'all was heading y'all no, was going. London, London tried to hold me. I told him Scar tried to cut me, but Scar never had no razor in his hand. Scar fake when he put his breathe. They, they didn't really know who I was. They, they wasn't sure. And when the whole move went down, they tried to they tried to fake a move. I be hating when dudes fake it. Son didn't even have no raise in his hand. Son, if he did, he dropped it. But when son touched me, because son did touch me on my face, son. But not, now look at son. Son, not son. If, it, if he had it, it didn't even cut me, son. But son, son, I, son was faking a move, son. I ready to beat son up, son. You hear me? I tried to beat him up. You feel me? And, um... They came to grab me, you know what I'm saying? Before, again, it was crazy, so I'm like, when I went back up to the thing, I told everybody what happened. Everybody was like, yo, we going out there in the morning. So we all went out there in the morning, none and all of us. Then suddenly they found out, like, I'm dudes like, yo, son, that's people, son. You already know what it is. So I'm like, yo, son, I ain't trying to hear nothing. Don't you know? Everybody apologized and all of that stuff. And they like, because ain't nobody, nothing happened. They were like, yo, you know, dude playing politics. Like, yo, ain't nothing happened. Nobody get cut. Ah, uh, uh, yo. Son, you ain't get cut, yo. Son, is, they like son is people. Son of them just didn't know who he was. Uh, London was like, yo, if you want to, you can. Let me tell you what son said. Son, son, I hope son, son is my home. Somebody lived there. I swear. Son told me on some little kid son, stuff, son. Son was like, yo, son, if you want to, son, you can, you can steal me. He told me I can punch him in the face if I want to. <laughs> but son, it was official though. But son, it's a lot of dudes that was official that became official later on that I, I, I met them on the interest. Because a lot of dudes, when they first come to the island, they don't really be nobody. You know what I'm saying? But they learn the game. They learn. And you know, sometimes it opens up and builds something in them. And whoever they are basically come out. And then they come out. And next thing you know, the dude, he was there. He probably got robbed back when he was on the island. But now some running around, you know, blazing stuff and got a little name for itself. And probably wasn't nobody in the street or wasn't nobody when he first got there. But he learned the ropes. You feel me? Just like the dude. And, and that's what and that's what a lot of people so I was a cold punk on the island before we used to have less and then he was a punk in the street I sat the taste out of his mouth then when I came to the alley son had the jack in a four building among schools you feel what I'm saying so yeah that's 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 what some people really love about Rikers Island though man like it's like it's like it's unpredictable who's gonna Who's gonna come? Who's gonna come into power in that motherfucker? You never, you never know. Son, I be coming with your Alex, and I used to be asking like, I used to ask people. I'd be like, Yo, man, like I run into a dude, and I'd be like, So, cause I'm, I'm really don't try to embrace the dude, try to feel what he's doing, son, because I'm not gonna embrace no lame, son, because I don't know who you are on the Alex. I only know who you are in the street. You feel what I'm saying? The mm -hmm. island is a whole different animal. That's cause you, this dude in the street, don't mean you that same dude on the Alex, son. I already know. You feel me? Mm -hmm. So when I see a dude, I be trying to feel about to see, like, especially if you're from the hood, you know what I'm saying? Especially from my block or something on my hood. Man, let me see what's up. What you doing? So you got, you got, you on the phone, son? You using that phone down there? First thing I ask the dude, so I'm like, yo, son, what's up? You using the phone in that you in, son? Like, this one of my brothers. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm asking, though. I'm asking him in front of his whole room. I see them. They go in the child, son. I'm probably in the hallway with a, with a barber pass, son. They go in the child. I go to him. I ain't with his unit. I think, yo, son, what up? I see you. I'm like, what's up? You touching that jack? What's up? You touching that jack, you man? Right in front of everybody in his house. So they go to, you feel what I'm saying? Put him right on the spot. You feel me? Just like that. So you touching that jack? I see you with your house. I see your unit. What's up? You touching that jack up in there? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Put right on the spot. You know, you ask me, I'm like, you already know it, son. You already know. I right, come on. What's up? You still don't need to be explained. I'm touching it. Ask these chunks. <laughs> Who touching it? Yo, but like, all right, so how did like, how, when, who was the first motherfucker that, if there was a motherfucker, who was the first person that taught you about the Rikers Island, the C74 phone culture? Cause like, was it really that you wanted to get on the jack, or was it that you needed to run that jack to let niggas know who you was? Nah, see, like with the phone culture thing, it's like me, son. Like, son, it's like I'm an alpha, so it's like whatever you gotta, like whatever position that the alpha supposed to play, I'm gonna try to assume the position. You know what I'm saying? So we in the position, we in the alley, and we in the unit. And the, the alpha is the dude that got the phone and got the most time on the phone. You feel what I'm saying? 
me being who I am, I'm going to try to assume, make an attempt to assume the position because sooner or later, if it's really not an attempt being made, but just natural, basically on who I am, I'm going to assume the position sooner or later. You feel what I'm saying? Because it's my birthright, so I'm going to assume that position. So when I go into a unit, it's like the phone coach is, like I said, is the man is the man who got the jack. And me, I'm all, and, I, and, I, and I'm a dude that want that power. You know what I'm saying? That's what I always wanted. So it's like, I, I gotta be the person in control. I can't be, I gotta be the alpha, bro. You know what I'm saying? I gotta be somewhere, I gotta be in control some type of way. You feel me? And that's what it was with me. And so with the phone culture, it came it came natural to me. And I'm coming into a unit like, yo, son, I'm letting people know, yo, like, yo, strength recognize strength. Like, if it's, I see some strong dudes, some real dudes that got the jack, I'm going to go to them and I'm going to give them my spell. Like, yo, son, I'm a, if we got to go gun to gun, you got to go. But, son, I need to touch that jack. Now figure it out, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm in here trying to cause no problems. I'm just letting you know I'm a man. And, like, yo, son, if y'all men and y'all recognize, I know y'all recognize strength when I see it, man. If y'all on some family time, then, yo, y'all on some family time, make sure y'all know I'm family. This is what it is. But if y'all not, and everybody just on man for everybody, man, man, everybody, man, man for themselves, and everybody just got time, then yo, what's up? Then, then we go rock. What's up? What's up? What's going on? Let's rock. You know what I'm saying? The dudes be like, yo, son, nah, son, ain't even like that, son. Let me tell you, son, you already know how it go. Dudes be trying to compromise and all of that. And like, yo, son, we gonna give you a half dead and a half at this So time. you said, what what, what house you said you was in mostly in 89? You said one 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 lower? Uh, oh, one no, lower. hold on, hold on. Oh, yeah, you already told about when y'all went out to the yard and the bank. So you said that, that was the house you had the jack in? You said it was one lower at the time? I, yeah, I had the house. I had the jack in one lower and two lower. Let me see. Um, uh, Whatever house I was in in um, 89, other than one lower and two lower. The bing, mostly. <laughs> One lower, two lower in the bing. And, and who else had jacks in that in the four building at that time who was running houses and had the, like, had the Q, jack? Q, and Q was over in, uh, what's the name? He was, because when I came down in 90, Shu was in um the four building. He was like in Mod 9 or Mod 8. One of those, because all those things was always the same to me. Like Mod 8, Mod 9, I used to couldn't tell. I knew one of them used to be like a queen's house. I think March 7 at one time it was like like the MO house. It was two houses, like one side was Queens and one side was whatever. You know what I'm saying? But I know Shu had one of them phones over there in either Mod 9 or Mod 8. Because I seen Sun, because Sun had came through Helm, um, Helm Tree and um, who was it? It was Helm Tree and somebody else caught a case. They caught a case about some diamonds or something. I'm trying to remember who it was, but it was. Him, it was probably him three and a half. I can't remember, but they all three had came through, and dudes had went home. But I think shoot, I think six months later, um, they had went home from. I think, and then six months later, um, shoot got indicted. You know how they send you home, and then they, like you don't get indicted when you first go to criminal court, and so they send you home until you got six months to get indicted. But they make it into a misdemeanor, and then um, so they came back six months later, and they had indicted him on a on a joint or whatever. You know what I'm saying? And um, son was there. And I seen son. He was there. He was. He had the phone over there. Somebody else. Somebody had, had the phone in bar nine too. Um, what his name is? Son. Son from the Bronx. Because I was in Adam and a lot of times. You know what I'm saying? I was in Adam and Shake, so I used to be there. Like I used to get kicked out of population. So I used to be in Adam and and dudes like it's pre day. So when dudes used to catch shots. They used to have to come down to either one lower or two lower. Both of them were anime saying I was in both of them. So dudes would have to come to me, got Tony, um, because on one side was anime saying and the other side was um population. But the thing about it, all of us, we all ate inside the unit. They didn't let us go, they wouldn't let us go to because all of this was all of the dudes that they didn't want a population that had influence, dudes that, you know, was supposed to be somebody or whatever in adolescence. They had us all trapped down there. You know what I'm saying? And wouldn't let us go to the child hall. And we was on the adult side because we was over there in, the, on, in one lower. You know what I'm saying? So we was on the adult side. So we used to eat in the unit. And so when dudes do something and you catch a shot, they used to send a, a ticket. That you, they used to send you to, to Adam and Say. So you down there and, and, and administrate. Adam and Say, that's administrative segregation. 
right? They just send dudes down there, and they be there waiting to see what's gonna happen at the, at the um at the um bing hearing. You know what I'm saying? And then once they have whatever happened at the bing hearing, they be there basically pre bing waiting to go to the bing. You know what I'm saying? So when dudes come down there, it be dudes, a lot of dudes that be like, they might have cut somebody, rob somebody, cut somebody, and these be dudes that supposed to be somebody to come there because they done cut somebody or did something. So when these dudes come down there, and you already know that phone situation, you already know I got the jack, you know what I'm saying? So when you come down there, and I used to be letting dudes know, like, yo, bro, <laughs> yo, son, I had to tell them, son, ain't nothing happening, bro. They be like, yo, I'm like, yo, let me, I let them know as soon as they get there. Let me holler at you, son. But listen, that phone situation, they be like, nah, son. I'm, not. I'm like, no, 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 son. I'm letting you know, son. That phone situation, bro. Because <laughs> they be just, they be quick to tell me, like, yo, son, I'm not here. I'm just here, son. I'm not here for no, you know what I mean? I'm, I'm here. I got, a, I got a ticket. I'm waiting to see what they're going to do. I'm going to the bank. I, I understand all of that. But that phone situation, son, ain't nothing happening. You know what I'm saying, son? Ain't nothing happening. It was me. I had, like, even, even when I was two, I had, I had no drama down there, no Brave Dave. And the Bronx dudes that was down there, back there, and, like, from, like, 88 to, like, 92, they should all know, they know some from the Bronx, some getting in, from the age them getting in, too. I had son down there, had, um, the low man, what's his name, man? What's shorty little name, man? He was from, he was from, um, son was from, um, What's the name? He, he was from, um, I think he's from like Evans Field or something. No dude, because I know he was beef with one of them dudes from the Bronx. They had some super beef. They always be fighting in the law library. You know all of that, man. But, um, son, yeah, but, uh, but a lot of dudes, a lot of dudes that came down there, son. Dudes was coming down there, son, and son. So you said nobody never came down there trying to just straight dead the Jack? Man, it's not, son. It's not, son. Don't disrespect me like that, son. I'm saying a nigga could have came down there and tried. Son, 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 <laughs> son, 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 listen, son, this is something, son, this is something for real, son, right, son, and son, if I walk into the room and I see you, son, I'm going to feel your energy, son, remember they say strength recognize strength, son, that's some real stuff, son, you know what I'm saying, and that's how I got a lot of phones, son, going to units and I see who the strong is and I can feel the energy and I'll be like, yo, I already know I'm more manly than them, son, because you got to remember, son, us dudes like us, we're the epitome of masculinity. You feel what I'm saying? It's like we're pure alpha males. And so when we go into certain, like, um, circles of men, the men recognize the hierarchy. And they be like, yo, this is the king. Yeah, we all got to submit. You feel what I'm saying, son? So it's like, I a <laughs> different type of animal, son. It's like, if I go in the room, son, I don't care if it's, um, Dude that ate the body, Jeffrey Dahmer, I don't care, Bin Laden, I don't care, Muhammad Ali, I don't care, it's the men of the men who represent manhood to the people who they visualize as a man. If I go in the room with them, son, I'm going to look them in their eye, they're going to know, like, yo, that dude right there is a man, and if I got a problem with him, I need to be getting at him, because son going to get at me. You feel me, son? Everybody, anywhere I go, the person in the room going to know that I'm a man. They're going to know that I'm going to be dealt with on your level. I don't care how many people you ate. How many people you shot or killed, or I don't care, you know what I'm saying? Like uh, Style said, I don't care who, I don't care who you shot, or you know what I'm saying? I don't care uh, uh, whoever you shot, you know, all of that stuff, you know what I'm saying? Whatever, like son, I don't care, son, who you are. You are gonna recognize me as a man when I step in the room. I'm just as man as you are, more manly, bro. If you ain't gonna be more man than me, I'll be just as man as you are, more manly than you, bro. And you gonna recognize that. And that's how I approach every room that I go in, son. This is why I say nothing. You know? This is when you was an adolescent or you was on the adult side of the four bed? I was an animal lesson. I was an adolescent.